Hello, I'm Daryl Duvall with Complete Insurance of Eau Claire. Let us do the shopping for you. Today I would like to talk about auto insurance and the coverages that are there. Usually the first line that's on your policy that you see is bodily injury or liability coverage. This is what covers you if you hit another person in a car accident. That coverage, if it's $100,000, $300,000, will show up on your policy as $100,000-$300,000. What that covers is the $100,000 per person, $300,000 for multiple people. So you want to make sure you have enough coverage on there to help cover their medical bills. The next number would be PD or property damage. $100,000 is usually enough to cover the uh, other person's property, be it a car or multiple cars or whatever got hit in the accident. The next line usually is UM or uninsured motorist somebody hits you and doesn't have insurance, that line of coverage is what covers you and your people in your car. So if you have 100000 300000 that's all that that uh, policy is going to pay for coverage. So in some cases, you may want to look at upping that coverage to 250000 or half a million per person. Um, next line down will be underinsured motorists. So let's say that you hit somebody or somebody hits you and it exceeds the coverages that they have whether it's 100 300,000 or 250,000 250,000 or half a million and the medical bills exceed that well then this one kicks in and pays out to the limits that you have on your policy next one down would be med pay right now that's at 10,000 or 25,000 it's usually a quick payout for little fender benders finger smashed in doors you know uh, chiropractic adjustments, small payouts. Uh, next one I want to talk about is comp deductible. A comp deductible is usually something that happens to your car when you're not driving it. You know, you have it parked in a garage and the garage falls in on it, your comp coverage uh, after the deductible will usually repair uh, the car. Uh, also, comp coverage covers deer hits. Collision. Collision is something where someone or you are driving your car and you drive into something or back into a mailbox or a car you didn't see. You pay the comp deductible and the insurance company pays the rest to fix your car. Uh, roadside assistance, that's where towing or they bring out gas or pull you out of the ditch. And usually in most of these policies, it's very inexpensive to have that on there. A rental car, if your car is disabled because of an accident, um, this is, rental car is available for you and it, it can pay $20 a day, $30 a day, or $50 a day. That's what helps pay your bills so you can still go to work and do the things that you need to do because your car was in an accident. Also on these are in the same coverages is, is motorcycle insurance. You'll have a lot of the same coverages. Um, four wheelers Make sure when you're looking at your four-wheeler policy, it has coverage for off of your property. So if you're out riding trails, you want a policy that will cover that. Snowmobile coverage, uh, same thing. And our trailers, let's say you got a four-wheeler and a snowmobile and you got a nice trailer to go with that. And you paid uh, a good amount for your trailer and you want it covered in case you know it gets damaged while it's being driven down the road. That's where you would put the comp and collision on your trailer. So if you got a nice snowmobile trailer, you paid $1,600 for it. It's got a cover on it and everything else. You have it parked out in your backyard and all locked up and somebody steals it. If you don't have a uh, comp and collision on it, it's not covered. So I'm Daryl Duvall with Complete Insurance of Eau Claire. If you have any questions on the following information I've covered, give us a call. Thank you.